Okay, since uh, leaving Melbourne, I spent a bit of time in Dallas with the Mavericks, working out with them and playing on their summer league team. Uh, I was also lucky enough to make the Boomers team that we went and played in the World Cup. And this last season, I was playing in Spain with Zaragoza. And just finished that up about a month ago. Yeah, I'm really excited to have signed with Melbourne United for the upcoming season. Uh, I think we've got a good group of guys and a new exciting coach. So uh, I'm really looking forward to the to the season beginning and, and getting out on the training track and building the chemistry with the new teammates and my old teammates, and then uh, ready for the season to start. Yeah, obviously things have changed a little bit since last time I was here and it was the Melbourne Tigers. But um, having spoken to everyone, everyone's really excited about the changes that have been made. Um, we had some pretty good crowds when I was with the Tigers and uh, I know that the last game of the season was a sellout for United. So um, looking forward to plenty more sellouts at, at High Sense and whenever, wherever we play this year. Yeah, so my off-season, I'm spending it in Brisbane. Um, I'm training up there and spending some time with uh, family and friends that I haven't seen in, in quite some time. And uh, I'll be back in Melbourne pretty soon to start pre-season training with the United guys. Yeah, I've met the new coaches. Uh, we sat down and had lunch not too long ago. I met with uh, Mike and Dean. And look, I'm really excited about the philosophies that we spoke about and uh, the way that they're going to handle the team this year. I think it's uh, it's a new and exciting brand of basketball and all the Melbourne United fans are uh, they're going to be happy when they see the product that's out on the court. Yeah. Just wanted to let you know I'm uh, really excited to be back. Looking forward to, to getting into pre-season with the guys and can't wait to step out on the court in front of